We filmed in the woods behind the house where I grew up. This is the forest I played in as a small child. Everything in the video was planned, everything was deliberate. Um, all of these characters, I, I wanted to play a specific role within this sort of very multi-layered metaphor and very complex sort of concept. I used to be an actor, so being able to be the one behind the camera and have control over everything that happened was actually really empowering and uh, kind of healing for me. I, I think being an actor, being in front of the camera, not being able to see the monitor, not knowing what was happening, it was such a vulnerable feeling. Um, and it was so exciting and empowering to be the person telling everyone what to do. I realized what it feels like uh, when you're directing actors and asking them to give you emotions. I really appreciated the trust that everyone placed in me because, you know, all of the extras showed up not knowing what the hell was going to happen. <laughs> it's really interesting to be the person who's in charge and sort of trying to lead in a way that causes people to trust you while also not having the time to explain the artistic reason behind what you're asking for. I built the mirror box with my mom. Uh, it's just a plywood 2x4 frame with plexiglass mirror, but it's actually quite magical in real life. I was really shocked actually at how invisible it was on camera. As we all noticed, we just couldn't see it the moment it was in the frame um, until someone stepped into it, which was really cool. I hit on this idea of a camera on a tripod turning in a circle, um, which I think I stole partly from a Julia Jacqueline video. The circular motion of the camera wound up being one of my favorite aspects of the video because it just, it brings so much interesting emotion into it. It, it really mimics the feeling of being lost in the woods and turning around and around to find where you are and you can't, you can't figure out where you are. Jared Rabb uh, was my collaborator on this. He made the whole thing happen. I definitely could not have made this video if Jared hadn't stepped in. Um, he shot it, he figured out all the equipment, he got the camera, he helped produce. He did so much and in doing so kind of taught me what to do also. Jared's also a great director, so he definitely picked up the slack for me and caught my mistakes before they happened. Um, he actually even went so far as to make this digital visualization of the video um, because it took a lot of planning, all the, all the timing of how long the camera turns took, how, you know, how fast everything unspooled. It had to be planned really tightly in order to work. I think that the older I get, the more that I am willing to allow my imagination to unspool. I think when I was younger, I didn't give myself the time to fully realize something. And now I'm willing to give myself that time and I feel lucky to know people who are willing to give me that time.